Hey Z Droppers, thanks for being here. Today we're going to run Renews using the Z Drop Chrome extension and we're going to change prices. All of this using the feature tools right on top of our Facebook marketplace here. Pause if you need to and let's go. Our options here are as follows. Delete items that cannot be renewed. So as you know, there is a limitation to how many times you can renew a listing before Facebook deems it as unsellable and you'll have to go ahead and either relist the listing or just call it a dud. So after seven times, ZDrop gives you the option here to go ahead and delete those items that cannot be renewed. We have the option to clear all listings from our marketplace with delete all. We have check renew status, which is what we'll be working with today. Renew all, get product ID. We'll be talking about that in a future video. And price changer. Let's go ahead and check the renew status. We'll click and ZDrop will start running through and it will start checking to see if there are any eligible listings that can be renewed. If so, it is renewable. It's running through each listing. This one is not renewable for another four days. If it was, ZDrop would alert us. Now let's go ahead and see if we can renew all of our listings and it will start to run through. One thing, if it is not an eligible renew status, ZDrop will not renew the listing. Moving on, let's go ahead and change the price. The price changer feature will start to change all of the prices in our listing. First, it will bring up another tab. It'll change the price. It'll go ahead and update the listing, going right back to our listings to work on the next one. If you have any questions, be sure to write ZDrop. Our next video will learn how to easily place orders with the ZDrop extension. Until next time, subscribe to the ZDrop YouTube channel in order to hear about new updates and features. See you next time.